ass cheeks spread, reflection of pussy off mirror. I'm the only one here that can hear her. And I fear for my life right now, only visible queer to step foot in this town. They all mistake me for an 18-year-old boy, and I'm not going to correct them. Because if one figures it out and kicks my ass, the rest will only respect them. Makeup is caked over a scar on her face. Maybe from the night she forgot her mace or she wasn't wearing the right kind of lace for her pay date. And I'm not gawking at her body, I'm looking into her eyes. Because what she's doing right now is all muscle memory and lies. I see a cocaine haze of pain that remains from the day she was taught to disconnect from her God-given flesh and forget about the meaning of respect. I see a long life of loss that costs cash for ass. And I want to whisper sweet lies into her ear and run loving hands over every square inch of her flesh so for a second she can forget about the hell on earth to which she's been sent. So she can forget about all the shots to the face, unwanted ass slaps and backs of cabs, all the fucks that felt like stabs to her identity, to her energy. But I won't try to take her home, show her love, make her come, because then I'd be her. And she'd be the man sitting next to me. A circle of distraction for temporary satisfaction. And some people don't get it because they've never been in it. They've never taken the time to listen. They've never given themselves permission to look into the eyes of a stranger and try to understand their decisions. Thank you.